Hello everybody, I'm Jim McMahon, and with me is Gorilla Metso. All right, Blood Bowl 2020 teams, we've got the Orc Leagues. Now, Orcs are the team that have long stood as the intro team, the team that at most coaches say, if you want to start simple, start with Orcs. Jim, is that still the case in Blood Bowl 2020? <laughs> Probably not, due to the animosity rule that they've given. Oh, yeah, now, wait a second. Animosity, that doesn't seem to belong. Let's go right through these changes, Jim. Yeah, there's actually a bunch of changes. So, um, the troll is 5k more expensive. He's an untrained troll, unlike the goblin and black oak troll. So, he's got, he's got a 4 plus loner instead of a 3 plus loner. Uh, goblins are, you know, pretty unchanged. Oak linemen are pretty unchanged. A little bit worse at passing, but... They've got animosity for other orc linemen. So if they, if an orc lineman has the ball and wants to pass a hand off to another orc lineman on a one, he can't do it, and his turn immediately ends. His action. <laughs> Throwers are five k cheaper. That's just the same as passing as they were in uh, Blood Bowl twenty sixteen and uh, Blood Bowl two. So they're they're identical to how they were in Blood Bowl two and Blood Bowl twenty sixteen, except for five k cheaper. And they've got animosity all teammates. So if your thrower ever wants to throw the ball, you've got to roll a two plus. Otherwise, his action ends. That's a so that's a real rule. I don't want to derail us here, but I think we're gonna have the same. Uh, we're gonna say the same thing about blitzers in a minute. But like. Thematically speaking, uh, you could make the case to me that orc linemen don't want to hand off to other orc linemen. It seems a little arbitrary, and that maybe even orc throwers don't want to hand off to anyone else because they think they're the best. But the thrower should be the guy without animosity in my book, Jim. <laughs> yes, yes, it's ludicrous. It's absolutely ludicrous. That's, that's the worst thing you could have done, <laughs> in my opinion. Uh, blitzes are still 80k. Uh, slightly worse at passing, still got block, same access, and they've got animosity to all teammates. So if it, yeah, and that makes sense, right? If a blitzer's got the ball, he ain't going to give it to anyone else. That that that's perfect, actually, for blitzers. I think you know, I think that's great because, and you know, you could give it to all linemen that they would give it to no teammates as well. Because if an orc gets the ball, he wants to score. That would be right. fine that they have it for all teammates. But it's weird that orc linemen will defer to a blitzer and give him the ball. I guess that's the idea, right? They would defer to the blitzer and give him the ball, but not another orc lineman. Um, so, but if a blitzer gets it, that's it. He's the star of the show and he's not going to give it to anyone else. But a thrower? <laughs> it's yeah. terrible. And this is what this is the buff of the team. I mean, this is this is really pretty good, right? Big and blockers. They're not black orcs anymore. They're big and blockers, and they're ten k more, but they get a point of movement. So like that's a, that's a really big buff. You know, you'd probably every single player in Blood Bowl, you'd probably pay ten k to be one movement faster. So, <laughs> so that's pretty good. Um, they can't pass it at all, and they've got animosity between other big and blockers. So if you want to hand it off from one big and blocker to another. You probably can't. <laughs> well, not you probably can't. You've got to roll two plus, <laughs> but you, you've also got to make an agility four plus roll anyway. <laughs> yep. So yeah, it's weird. It's so weird. Like, if you're never going to pass it, animosity is or hand it off, then animosity isn't a big deal, and it's it's never a big deal. But it's just an extra hurdle to cross, isn't it? It's like it seems totally a totally unneeded nerf and over complication of one of the basic starting teams as you say every everywhere you go i always i always recommend orcs for starting people and now you can't anymore really because you've got to deal with animosity yeah that really that really it doesn't seem like a lot when you think about it. it's a two plus if you're handing off to specific players but that will absolutely ruin the game for a new coach at some point <laughs> and that's just not what you want to learn on you know it, it, it simply isn't and I gotta say, Jim, I can hear I can hear the disdain in your voice, the disappointment. Mr. Throw, your favorite player on the Blood Bowl pitch, no longer really viable at all. Would like you used to always field Mr. Throw, the, the Oric Thrower. Uh, and now would you ever put him on the pitch again, Jim? <laughs> no, I didn't play him because he was movement five and not movement six, and now he will never, ever, 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 ever ever get a chance for me um <laughs> what is nice though is you can have uh, you know in this new system of buying stat ups and 
you're so likely to get a plus movement. Um, I would definitely invest into stats for blitzers. And then, you know, you can easily have a movement eight blitzer. And you could also easily get plus strength for them as well, right? You're not it's not unlikely to get plus strength. And although the TV is a lot for plus strength, if you had a team of four plus strength blitzers, <laughs> that would be... Yeah. That'd be pretty good, and uh, even if just a couple of them got it, or even one, you know, if, if you just put in the if you put in the uh, stats just to get a movement eight, blodge, sure hands carrier, that's going to be a fantastic blitzer, isn't it? And then he's not really going to care about handing it off or anything because he's movement eight. Absolutely. Well, there is the orc team blood bowl twenty twenty leaks. Not a team that I'm very excited about to play myself, but if you're an Orc fan, you're already dedicated, you can get your Mr. Throws, and they can go out there and refuse to pass the ball all you want. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Jim. Anything else you got on the Orcs? Thanks, Gorilla. Yeah, um, one thing for starting rosters, um, they get 10k short of their desired roster. Um, it used to be 970 for pretty much the standard roster of four Blitzers, four Black Orcs, three linemen. Now you can't do that. Um, because the blitzers are, are ten, uh, the, sorry, the big and blockers are ten k more. So what you, what I would do, I would have four blitzers, four big and blockers, a goblin, and two orc linemen, and then three rerolls. And then after the first game, I would sack the goblin and get a journeyman orc lineman instead. <laughs> um, so you would doing that, you would kind of cheat an extra ten k if you like uh, for your starting team. So yeah, I mean. The animosity is terrible, but plus one movement on the blockers is actually a really good buff. But it is definitely offset and almost overshadowed by the animosity, I would say. And, well, fair uh, enough, yeah. A little bit more complicated to play. Um, like, I, I think Orcs are just one of those teams, you know, the people who play them will always play them. And then a lot of people coming into this are going to take a look at it. I just no longer think they hold that crown of being the team to learn blood ball on yeah exactly yeah i think that's the big i think that's a bit of a shame because they i mean animosity is okay thematically you know animosity is literally a rule that the orcs have had in warhammer but um i think it adds a layer of complexity that doesn't really add a lot um i don't know people i guess people might like it as well right when they they might chuckle about their blitzer while they're throwing not wanting to pass it who knows <laughs> Yeah, that's generally what I play Blood Bowl for, to sit there, roll a one, and then have my turn be completely ruined. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, they might enjoy it. And if you don't, then it's your fault for <laughs> taking a throw Fair with enough. animosity. <laughs> All right, well, that is your Blood Bowl 2020 work team. Are you going to play them? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for having me, Jim. Thanks, Gorilla. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.